Building a home is an exciting yet complex decision, and one of the primary considerations is the material used in construction. In recent years, stone has gained popularity as a building material due to its durability, aesthetic appeal, and natural qualities. However, when considering whether to build a 100 square meters house with stone, there are several factors to take into account, including cost, maintenance, insulation, and environmental impact. One of the primary advantages of building a house with stone is its incredible durability. Stone is resistant to weather conditions, pests, and fire, making it a solid choice for long-term investment. Stone structures can last for centuries if maintained properly, meaning the house will stand strong for generations. In the case of a 100 square meters home, this means that the house could endure much longer than traditional materials like wood or even concrete which may wear down faster over time.
Stone houses are known for their timeless beauty. The natural textures and colors of stone add a unique charm and rustic elegance to any home. Whether you choose natural stone, limestone, or granite, the exterior and interior of a stone house have a distinguished, classic look that is hard to replicate with other materials. For many homeowners, the visual appeal of stone is a significant reason to consider it for a 100 square meters home, as it adds a level of character that modern construction materials may lack. While stone offers numerous benefits, one of the significant downsides is the cost. Stone construction is generally more expensive than wood or even concrete. Not only is the material itself costly, but the labor involved in working with stone is also more specialized and often requires skilled artisans. For a 100 square meters house, this could translate into a higher overall construction cost, which may be a crucial factor for many homeowners. Additionally, transporting heavy stone materials can add to the expenses, especially in areas where stone is not readily available. Another important consideration when building a stone house is insulation. Stone is not as energy efficient as other materials such as wood or insulated concrete. It tends to absorb heat and cold, which could make the interior of the home uncomfortable in extreme weather conditions. A stone house may require additional insulation or advanced HVAC systems to maintain a comfortable temperature year-round. This can add to both the initial construction costs and long-term energy bills. Stone is relatively low maintenance compared to other materials like wood, which may require regular treatment for pests, moisture, or decay. However, it is important to note that over time, stone can experience weathering, particularly in areas with high moisture or extreme temperature fluctuations. Regular inspection and maintenance may be required to preserve the structural integrity and appearance of the house.
In terms of environmental impact, stone is a natural and sustainable material. However, the energy required to quarry, transport, and shape the stone can have a significant environmental footprint. Depending on the local availability of stone, the carbon emissions related to its extraction and transport could outweigh its benefits as a sustainable material. Building a 100 square meters house with stone can be a great decision if you prioritize durability, aesthetic appeal, and the long-term investment it offers. However, it's important to weigh the higher costs, insulation challenges, and maintenance needs before proceeding. For those who value timeless beauty and can manage the financial investment, a stone house can be an extraordinary choice. But for others looking for a more affordable or energy-efficient solution, alternative materials might be a better fit. In the end, whether or not to build a 100 square meters house with stone depends on your budget, climate, and personal preferences. It's essential to consider all these factors carefully to make an informed decision that best suits your needs. Thank you so much for watching my video.